everybody. We're so glad you're here. Thank you so much for joining us. You know, every time I see that video, every single time, and I've seen it a few times, I love it even more because really what it shows is the real true way in which we create our wearable works of art. And the artistry that goes into each and every single style that you get into your stores is it's breathtaking to me. And that's why I still love seeing that video all the time. And keep in mind, if you ever need that video for a trunk show or some sort of a, a, an occasion that you're perhaps uh, have your rep in store and you're, you're, you're having a special, uh, special event, you can go into our, um, into our vendor page and also ask your rep and we'll send it to you and then you can run a continuous loop on it. Um, because it's really, it's, to me, it's still mind boggling that we can make footwear that's actually hand painted. The L'Artiste brand is hand painted, wearable works of art. And you saw our artisans right in person doing that. So um, I'm, glad that, I'm glad that I still love it and I hope that you love it as well. So let's get into what we wanted to talk about today and the reason that we're all here. And that's about L'Artiste sandals for spring, summer 2023. Okay. So we wanted to first start with some trends and that we have a little bit of a, you know, a couple of things that we wanted you to see. We're going to put it up on the screen and we're just going to go through. I thought of some buzzwords. I thought of some, some key things that I thought might be helpful for you. And perhaps maybe you're already thinking in the same way, but um, you can use, this is information you can use when you start to plan your spring 23 uh, L'Artiste assortment. And we just wanted to give them to you in a video. So some of the trends that we wanted to focus on really for L'Artiste is platforms, block heels, um, the colors are really dusty with the mints, the skies, the peaches, like sea glass, the things that you would actually find on the beach. And with that said, it's all about tranquility and rich naturals and surrender now, that whole ohm thing where, where you're really giving in. Um, and little things, big moments, which really made a big impact on me and perhaps all of us based on what's been going on over the past couple of years. Um, we're about effortless sophistication, we're comfort, we're artistry, um, styles that are uh, multifunctional. So part of the, one of the trends is getaways and you know, you really want your customers to be able to buy uh, from you that one or two style that they can wear throughout their vacation and that's either dressy or casual and have mul multiple wearing occasions. Um, so some other things are artisanal touches and rattans, wovens, desert tropics, western details. You're going to see some western details throughout the spring 2023 presentation, not only from Lartis, but from Springstep and Patrizia and some of the other brands that you're going to see out there. So let's get right into some of the trends and just a little bit of imagery. We're going to go, you know, fast through them. You, we're all about color. So not only are we having um, dusties and what we just talked about and the mints and the, um, and the sea glass peaches and blues, but also vibrant colors that bring you um, happiness and optimism and joyfulness and that's all that's what L'Artiste is all about and that's a big big trend going forward and slow down be present okay take a breath digging out dusties and that's part of that tranquility um, ohm sort of um, kick your you know cross your legs kick your heels take a walk on the beach with your kids and your dogs and um, that's part of that take a breath and slow down trend um, style meets comfort. Um, that's what we do. And, and that's really who we are as in all of our brands from spring, spring footwear. This is what we were talking about in the gateway collection. So your customers are going to want to be able to have multiple wearing occasions. So this is what we're calling that getaway collection where it's all about versatility and being able to buy that one sandal and having multiple wearing occasions. And there's the warmth of the sun and just chilling and relaxing, not only during the day, but at night. So a lot of our styles that you're going to be seeing are day into night. And because they're all day comfort, you're never going to want to take them off. And that's really what we're all about. Uh, let's create our future together. And we're all about boho, the raw crafts, hair made, and really, really the mantra of L'Artiste is comfortable, wearable works of art. And then some. So we're also going to talk to you right now about some of the best sellers and here's our top 10 and what you can really see is the family of constructions, not only in, you know, the, the cork wedges that you see in Roshni and Delight, uh, but you also see some flats 
um, in the Desi and the Parcel, which are closed casuals. And those are key items for us, and you'll see them all year round. Um, and that's what's so great about having open stock, where you'll always be able to fill in um, pretty much whenever you need them. So you start out with your basic size scale, um, and maybe you do three to five colors of these core items. And then when your customer says, well, I need more colors, then you know that you can go online and rep Spark um, and order them right by your right or on yourself by yourself, or you can call your rep and they'll help you with that. Sumaka and Cayman and also Pillow, those are all the same construction. And that's what we call a family of styles. And we've added some new family members and we'll show those to you in just a few minutes. And of course you have your Lay and your Karina as constructions and we've also added some new family members there as well. And Delight and Roshni as far as wedges and Tempest being wrapped, super, super product right now with those naturals, what's going on in the market where you have those wrap jutes and, and Rafa styles. So there you have a, just a recap of some of the best sellers that you will also see as we go forward. So we're gonna start with the first style, which is Reba. And you know who she's named after. So there's a little bit of a Western flair in here. And remember when I was um, mentioning before that we have multi-wearing um, multi occasions? so that um, our customers will be able to wear them both dressy and casual and that she's more of a, 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 an, all, an all day, an all year um, investment. So Reba has three adjustability straps here, which is very important. And that, what that means is that no matter what your gal's ankle looks like, whether she's super slim or a little fuller and more of an athletic, that this is the perfect fit for her. And she's really cool and I'm, and I'm creatively re Restrapping her here. She also has really pretty embellishments on here. They're decorative, the embellishments. This is what we were talking about with this block heel and this hand painting detail. So she's on a stacked, a combination stack and hand painted embellished heel. Even the insoles, even the footbeds are done by hand and you can see what looks like a stitching detail. Really pretty flowers, all hand painted. Another one of our great styles that are really trend right is style art deco and you can see why we named her that because she has that sort of art deco-ish 20s 30s uh, feeling with all of the multicolorations and the top of the heel has more of a, a diamond design in that deco inspired look she's closed back she is zip up so once you lace her up you can just zippity doo dah yourself in there and you're set to go you also see some studding details so you see studs all the way around these mice Nice, not only dusties, but there's also some vivids in here when you get into the black. Oh, I wanted to show you. We're going to intersperse a couple of the handbags in here. We think it's really fun. So here was a great new style in the handbag, and we'll have a separate presentation for you going forward. Um, our handbags are still coming in right now. But you see a little bit of a Western inspiration here with this all this hand tool design. And of course, we have feet at the bottom here, and you have multi-compartments. So she's a, she's a really, really cool, inspired uh, Western dyna. So you've got all that whip stitching here, that cording detail. Check out Geneva. So here's another example of the block and the platform. You have this really great platform. Let me give you an idea on how much, how tall this, this platform is. She's about one inch, and you can see all the hand tooled and all the hand painted detail on the outside. And look at the heel. I love the heel. She's all hand tooled and hand painted. She comes up to, to the top of the footbed, she's three and a half. So with a one, she's a two and a half pitch, which really isn't that much, right? When you're talking about how far you are off the ground. Um, and you have a really, really fun squared off toe, which makes her product right as well. And she does have a sibling, and her name is Gama. So Gama is the same exact construction. The mint that you see on screen will be a little bit more vivid as far as your samples. This is an, an initial sample that came in, and she will be a little bit more um, minty. But she also is hook and loop here and also here for adjustability. The same squared off toe with some embellishments here. You have a cabochon surrounded by an antique embellishment there and all of this hand painting detail, super duper cool. And again, a little, a little you know, Western inspired and yet you still have all that artis artisanal ideas and all that beautiful hand painted work, even the footbed, let me show you that. Even that footbed has some really pretty carving design on there for a great shelf appeal. 
So I absolutely love her. She's fabuloso and she really is. She comes in two colors. I'm really partial to this yellow, but when you look at the orange on Angie's foot, you're gonna see that both colors have a lot of longevity. Love, love, love this really pretty feminine floral design that goes all the way around on the midsole, on the toe, on the center part of each side of the stacked heel. She is also hook and loop and a very, very fashionable T-strap design. And look how cool she looks with this purse. There's just something about her that shouts fashion, fun, joyfulness, um, all of the above. And she does have a padded back, um, backstrap as well. Her sister's name is Avant-Garde. It's the same construction. In this case, you have a little bit more of a 70s pop art look with these floral designs. So in this particular case, the gray has a little bit of a mustardy and orange effect. She does have a padded back strap. She has the hook and loop with a little floral embellishment, but look how fun she is. So you have her in the tan and you also have her in the gray. I'm gonna give you a little bit of measurement here. So to the top of the footbed, she's four and a quarter. And when you get to the front, she is one. So it's a three and a quarter pitch. And you can see how gentle the pitch is on Angie's foot once again. Continuing with uh, platforms and also the block heels is Guitara. There was something about her that reminded us of a guitar when we were naming her. She has a nice padded strap for your heel in the back. She is hook and loop. She's got fabulous cork midsole all the way around and the welt is also stitched. So I'm just gonna go over some more details. She's hook and loop here and here. So she's totally open, which is super, super cool. Again, with that padded heel. And look how pretty the, the wrapping is on the heel. So you are cork, which means she's gonna be very, very comfortable. And then the back of the heel contrasts beautifully. Again, that shabby chic look with the mixture of hand painting and all that artisanal detail. And there you have Guitara. And her sister's name in a slide is Gwenna. So Gwenna is that same construction. I didn't give you the measurements there. She's three and a half to the inside of the footbed. And she's also about one in the front. So she has that same cork midsole. She also is hook and loop that you can see some pretty detailing on the inside. Look how pretty the upper is in this blue color. She's very, really soft, very feminine, very joyful. That serenity now beach glass look with all the dusty colors. Really pretty for a slide. So most of you know um, Jive and Jivy and how well we did with her and how well she performed for you on the selling floor. And we wanted to update her a little bit with a style that we're calling a star because we felt that she was going to be a star. She is hook and loop. She has that same fabulous construction with that nice heel that comes in in a slight sexy curve. She's wrapped at the bottom and you can see some really pretty dusty and vibrant. So we've got the whole thing going on as far as dusties and vibrance in this one particular style. She measures approximately three and approximately one. So she's got a really gentle two inch pitch. And look how pretty she is. So all four colors are really, really um, saleable and valid. And I can see you um, sort of bringing maybe two colors in and then the next two perhaps a month later. So Wildcat was a great, great seller for us. The reorders were fantastic, so thank you very much. And what we loved about her, and you know that we named her Wildcat for a reason, because look at that, out, the, the, the sole, the outsole here is all Wildcat, and even the bottom, you can see that she's um, got your animal print. And she has a, a, also the printed toe and the footbed. She's got a padded back collar. Of course, she is hook and loop in both places so you have all adjustability here for however your foot uh, customer's feet ails you and she's super duper comfortable she's got let's see she's a three and mm, a little bit more than a half and about a one in the front i like the fact that she's got some metallic touches to her along with some of the hand painted and tool designs on the strapping Look how pretty this new style is. She's called Chagall. She really reminded us of a, of a work of art in a painting. But here is the perfect example of where you see a little bit of vibrance on Francis's foot and then this dusty color here in the blue, how pretty it is. So you've got hook and loop with this very pretty cabochon centered flower. 
um, and you have all this pretty, pretty hand-painted detailing here. One thing that I want to point out that I see, think is super duper cool is look at the inside of the strap here on this strap. She's also lined in the same print that you see on the upper. So there's no detail that goes untouched by us and we're really proud of that and we hope that that helps you sell some of the styles. Very, very pretty colorations, very, very gentle slope. You've got a little bit of detailing on the bottom of the heel that matches the upper on these stacked heels and it's a little bit slimmer heel. So she's a little bit more dressy, although she can still be worn with jeans. Style Barry, we did so well with her, we're continuing with her. So we have her in the two colors right here. She is hook and loop. And she's also done in the dusty colorations, even on the matching footbed, which is super cool. And again, really nice uh, details for the selling floor. A double camichon um, embellishment. And look at this new heel we did. We're so excited, look at it. She's curvy and colorful and joyful and fun. And she's got um, the two colors here, plus the navy that you'll see on Angie's foot. She's got a wonderful curve right on the inside. You can see some stud detailing at um, the outside of the cork. Of course, she is hook and loop. And look how pretty the footbed is, too. Isn't that pretty with all the coloration there? I don't know if you can see her really well. There you go. Of course, um, super padding, as always. Again, comfortable and pretty. Lalani was a key item for us. She did really well. Again, she was a great reorder style for us. And there's a new color. Look how pretty she is in the white multi. A slightly different design, but she is still a white multi in the Lalani. You have your matching footbeds here and your tan and your gray. And you have a really pretty vibrant turquoise on your white Lalani there. She is also fully adjustable with your hook and loop. She opens all the way up and you can see here how pretty the etching design on your contrast, um, your contrast etching is on the tonal footbeds. She also has the cabochon multi-tiered flower and all of your tool design. And we wanted to show you this new pretty handbag, how fun she is. She comes in a few colors. We're gonna show you the tan right now and how cute she looks with the Lalani and tan. Just something fun and festive. And again, it's all about being joyful. Love adored. I adore adored. She's so pretty. She's so fun. She has the clear plexi on the upper with these beautiful, beautiful flowers on the top. She has double, like the, the, um, the wings of the, of the, what is this? this? These are the butterfly wings. Could you tell? So the wings on the butterfly are up here on the front strap. And then you have these very pretty, uh, delicate feminine flowers there and a flower uh, midsole and toe. And remember when we were kids and we would t go in and start picking flowers for our moms and we would dry them out and stick them in the book. Well, that's what's on the inside of this clear heel. So you have these really, really pretty soft colorations in actual real flowers on the heel. And her sister's name, her sister's name is Aritre. And she also is hook and loop. And the one thing that I'm gonna point out is, it's very hard to see, but when, um, when Frances turns her foot to the front, you'll be able to see that she also has that plexi front, that clear see-through, and the hand tool, the hand um, laser cut and hand painted design on the upper with a little bit of metallic here with a padded back sole. And of course she is hook and loop. Same clear heel with the pretty hand pressed flowers. Really, really delicate and very, very fun and pretty. So heels are a big, big story, and we're going to continue showing you some fun heels. This next style is called Cassell. What we, um, this is dinner date, I think. This is dinner date. So we're, I'm just going to back up a little bit. Is that one Cassell? So anyway, um, Doug's going to move us to dinner date, which is what we have here. There you go. And what's so special about her is the fact that from the front, she looks like a very elegant, Sort of casual, she's got beautiful burnishing, she's got highs and lows that you'll be able to see on her too. But what we love about her is when you turn around, so it's pretty coming and going, you have this awesome heel. She's got a lot of life, a lot of uh, personality. She's got a, a pretty stacked appeal. And remember the tin ceilings that are still in some of the, um, some of the vintage, more vintage older buildings? This is reminiscent of that tin, tin type on the ceiling. 
the top and the bottom and then the middle is clear. But I also like the fact that she has our signature rainbow stitching and opens up all the way for hook and loop adjustability, not only in the front, but also in the back strap. Look how pretty she is on the inside. Next style is illuminated and really another absolutely stunning example of fun heels. So one of the things that we were talking about is how we were going to um, market some of the heels and, and we got a little bit crazy and we started going, heel, yeah, you know, a little bit of Western tang, twang and, you know, just we're having a little bit of fun with some of the heels that we do. You can see that sexy slope on the inside there and she also has a little bit of... Um, three-dimensional looking um, stampings there with the, um, the inside is smooth. But what I love about her is the coloration. So the pink is just so beautiful. You're going to see a lot of pinks going forward in part of those dusties. And even when we, you're even going to see pinks in your vibrance. Look how beautiful the asymmetrical strap is with the flower detail. And you have metallic sort of cabochon stones that are encased in a gold setting. You have a um, padded back heel as well. And the blue is also equally as stunning. The blue has that silver heel and then the pink is a gold. You also have, oh, I meant to show you, you also have the welt design here, and there's a gold, uh, there's a gold threading right around the top of the welt on this um, cork midsole. So I hope everybody tried and were successful with Jewel. It was a key item for us. We loved everything about her when we were developing her, and we were, we were, putting the stone, different color stones in the heels, we really had a good time because we said, well, should we do her solid? Should we do her with multicolored stones? And we decided that the multicolored stones for the joyfulness of it all was really where it's at. And so when we added the new color that you see on Francis right now in the pink multi, we stayed with that beautiful, beautiful heel. So you have um, party shoes that a lot of our gals here in Florida, we wear with Daisy Dukes as well. So we wear them formally and we wear them really casually with a great pair of skinnies or short shorts and a great top and they go out. Notice how I say we. So another key item for us and something that we are continuing with because of the success of sales here is Style Amora. We're keeping her in the metallic. So you have the metallic bronze and the metallic blue and we added that really pretty rainbow color um, because we felt that we wanted to joyful her up a little even more than she was. Um, so you have the addition of the rainbow color and remember she is all day comfort. This is something that a lot of you were a little bit perhaps nervous to try initially and then as soon as your customers got into her they said and exclaimed how perfectly all day comfortable she was. The zip is an all day comfort zip and she's got great foot coverage as well. And we wanted to take that upper because she was so successful and we wanted to show her in to you in a little bit of a lower construction. So Icon is one of our most iconic constructions um, and you see her both in winter and in spring because of the popularity of this heel height. She also is a zip back as you just saw in Amora, but she has our basic key item construction in this heel. And we are going to show you some additional colors um, that we have coming in there haven't been here yet. We're going to do her because of the importance of this heel height and the upper being so strong. We wanted to add a navy white, a um, camel. It, it looks a little bit brown there, but it, it will be more of a camel and also a Turk as options. So you can see by the amount of colors how important this style will be for us. Same construction, and you, I'm, I'm sure most of you have um, already had the experience and the sell-through with Parshell. She does rank in our top 10, and she's an all-year-rounder, which is really cool for us because we have her in stock. You can start with your, you know, your initial size, size range because we're open stock. You can just initially give you your basic size range, and then what happens is your customer is going to come back for additional colors, so you know that you'll be able to get her um, you know you'll be able to get her because she's basically in stock. So a little bit of a pretty um, semi, uh, like a scalloped edge on the upper. She is hook and loop, but I also just want to point out the backs of her. So she has a really pretty, very subtle, very, very subtle um, floral design in the back, um, and she is all leather. And the strap, the Mary Jane strap, is all tooled and hand-painted as well, but subtle so that you can wear her both dressy and casual, and that was the idea. She is definitely volume. 
we did really, really great with this nice, what I call the salsa heel. She's curvy and she's sexy. And what we wanted to do was give her, give your gal an opportunity to run with a, an all day style, a great sexy heel, salsa. She's got an upper and the bottom is all part of this leather multicolored butterfly print, which is super, super cool. And look at the wonderful foot coverage that you see um, on Francis's foot. So if your gal doesn't have the, you know, the feet that she wants to show, but she still wants to have an open look, where you have that peep toe. So she's very, very vintage inspired with that peep toe, very pretty multicolored flower and a beautiful um, spiritual butterfly because you know the butterfly represents new beginnings and very spiritual. Okay. Thank you. The next style is visionary. So Visionary is another key style for us, and she's been in the line. She is a wonderful, another great reorder style for us. And what we love about her, aside from the hook and loop, is that she's got this wonderful laser cut design on the front. You can see her, let's see if we can see her in this nice um, mint color. You can see all of the etching design on the upper front. And I really like the fact that it's got some rickrack sort of shearing um, leather cuts there in, in the upper and a really pretty embellishment on the outside. Very, very sexy. This is another one of those South to Heel styles. Another key item for us, and she is going forward in all colors. So you remember Thule, our style Thule? She's a key item, and we're gonna show you her next, but we wanted to show you a new style that we developed because of the success of Thule, and that's style Eluta. So Eluta is an open back quarter strap with adjustability here in, in your strapping. Full coverage on the front, so for you gals who don't want to um, maintain a pedicure all the time, what we love about her is the fact that she's really feminine, really fun, great foot coverage, super duper comfortable, and she's got that same volume heel as we have on the Thule design. And look at this gorgeous new purse. So I'm really into tonals, and we were seeing a lot, a lot of tonals. That's part of that um, soft look going on. Let me see. If, let me move this back a little bit so you can see the design there. There you go. So you have a really, you have a great opportunity for a wonderful satchel that has um, almost like a briefcase effect, and you have your back zip, of course. But we're going to go over the uh, handbags at a different time. I just wanted to show you some of the things that we thought you might enjoy, so you can start thinking about how you might merchandise the floor. And here's Thule that we were talking about just before. And you can see all the colorations. We have five colors here. They're all going to go forward. Thule is a key item for us. She's um, all year rounder. What we love about her is that she's pretty basic in the front. Yeah, and you see she has your hook and loop with your tooled strap. And in all that hand tooling and hand coloring in the back also. So she's got a really nice coming and going sort of aura. And you look good bo going both ways. Avnia is another key item for us, and you can see why. Super pretty. She's got a closed heel. So we have a lot of customers, a lot of gals that don't really want to show their heels. And then maybe they just want to show a little bit of that vintage toast popping out there in the front. Scalloped edging all the way around, multicolored, hand-painted sort of um, daisies, if you will. And they're all etched in the middle. And you can see the three pretty colorations in the mint, the black, and also the camel. And this is, of course, a hook and loop closure. One of the most successful constructions in sandals that we also um, like to brag about is this construction on Avnia. Nope, on Classical. We just showed you Avnia. So the Classical construction is a multifaceted, um, I think, let me see how many sides. One, two, three. She has five sides on the heel. She's very, very lightweight. She's very flexible. I haven't really talked about the comfort on everything because I know by now you all know how comfortable the L'Artiste brand is and she continues to be. That's one of the things that we really take a lot of pride in. Not only do we make beautiful shoes, but they have to be comfortable. Let's face it, our gals want to be all day in their footwear and they like the compliments. Okay, so style classical, we have the three colorations and she's just a very simple all day go-to style that we will continue with. And we wanted to bring in something new for you and that's an aromas. What? Oh, how high is she? Okay, thank you for asking. So you can see how padded she is, how much she goes in. So on the top of the footbed, she's two and a half and she really doesn't have too much it's just like about a half an inch in the front. 
So two and a half and half, so she's a two inch pitch. And look how pretty Aromas is. This is the same, the same construction. We padded the back strap. She's beautiful in the white, isn't she? So it's a white beige um, coloration combination. She does have one, two adjustability. So you can see here how easy she is to get in and out. The asymmetrical flowers with the cabochons are just really sexy, sort of pretty, elegant, and very feminine. And you can see that we also matched the footbed. We wanted to have that more dressy appeal here, something that when your toe was showing on your footbed, it was the same color, especially in the black. And the carryover for here is Asterine in the back strap. And here's where we have the triple one, two, three adjustability here, and also where you have your matching footbed. And we have the two colorations here. This is that same construction that our customers love. You also have a little bit of metallic here. So she's a little bit dressier with the metallic, right? So the flowers also, and then you have your bronze embellishments right there, light as a feather and very flexible. And we wanted to give you one more slide in the same construction, and this is in style Renee. We only have the one color here, the blue, the navy blue didn't come in yet, but she's due in, and you know how great our navies are, so you never have to worry about that. She also has the hook and loop for adjustability to tighten her in or loosen her up, depending on how your customer's feet swell. And the little bit of the upper part of the heel has a floral design. All of your hand tooling here and your hand coloring and your cabochon embellishment on the, in, on the right in the center. So we're going to move on a little bit to some of the dusties that we were talking about earlier. And then these cork multi-colored cork with these beautiful, beautiful dusty colors. What you're seeing here is Anna Maria. And we can't say enough beautiful things about Anna Maria because she not only has a cork footbed and outsole, but she also has a continuation of the upper leather in the colorations and all of that nice um, laser cutouts and scalloped edging right around to the outside of the heel as well. So look how pretty the flowers, the hand-painted flowers are on the outside. You have a cabochon on the middle of the flower. The white came out beautiful. We're really happy with her because, you know, it's really hard to get the hand-painted whites. And we have a little bit of mints in the dusties here and also the blue edging, that denim blue with your wonderful scalloped edge. How pretty is the back, right, with coming all the way around with that leather design? Next style is Bloom. And she's really, really cool. She not only has, I'm going to give you a little bit of a, a measurement here because I think you might think she's high, but she's about three and three quarters to the top of the footbed. And then when you get to the front platform, she's about, oh, maybe one and a quarter also on the top of the footbed. But she's awesome. Look at her. The outside of this, of the wedge is all cork wrapped and she has a like a leafy feathery type effect here with some really wonderful natural cork on her. The footbed is surrounded by natural cork and the upper bloom is stunning. So you have a couple of layers, you have your cabochon and then wait till you see this, look at this. Is she not amazing? So this is a style that we offered this handbag for fall. She has a little bit of a Western flair. And look how it changes the sandal. So she can become a little bit of a Western style there. So if you have that flair or you're in an area that, um, that is really trending to this, this is a wonderful combination that you can um, offer your customers. Okay, another favorite is Demore. We wanted to show you the white multi on Angie's foot because when you see how great she looks in the white multi, there's a little bit of beige, there's a little bit of gray. She's very soft in those dusty colors. But what we want to point out is the fact that the outsole is a cork outsole with the bottom part has a multiple wrap. There's like four sort of layers of black and white wrapping right on the bottom. The leather of the upper goes all, wraps all the way around the outsole and then she's hidden underneath that wrap. Look how beautiful the colors are. She's also hook and loop. The insoles will match, the footbeds will match the uppers. And you can see how beautiful these soft dusty colors are in the mint, the camel, and also this navy along with that white. Super colorful, super pretty. 
Most of you also know about Tempest. She was another great reorder style for us. She does have the hook and loop and great foot coverage also for your gals that have sort of pinky toe and bunion issues. And then you have all this multiple um, hand cut rose embellishment right on the top of that leather flower, really pretty. And then we talked earlier in the beginning about the trends with the naturals and the organics and the jutes and the and, and what's going on as far as that uh, laid back style. But here you have that jute wrap with our signature rainbow stitching. But in this case, the signature stitching goes all the way around in sort of an arrowhead effect. And the ombre upper painting is really beautiful. Very, very special. So with that said, we had to give her a sister. I mean, there's, there's a backstrap and then now we have a slide. So what we've done here is we've also had an incredible upper coverage so that the gals that want to cover their feet a little bit more this this whole flower here this great soft multi-petaled here and don't look at the green on the inside because this is going to be all blue so you're going to see this really nice ombre blue that'll be um, on both sides the sample we were playing around with whether we should do it two-tone but we did decide that we were going to do her in solids with that ombre effect so you have your orange you're going to have your navy and we're also going to uh, have a beige coloration that has not come in yet eve's garden so th she has it all she has laser cut she has rickrack design we only have the one here so we're gonna we're gonna when we show you the image we're gonna put her on model but we wanted to show you that she is hook and loop with a wonderful multi uh, multi flower there but she has a really pretty rafa colorful rafa design on the outsole and then that nice jute with the um, signature rainbow stitching and we're going to get her on model and there you see the second color and that is the pink multi also very beautiful and she really she really is all the trends in one with that naturals the organics the dusties the wedges the surrender now and here you have angie on, on angie's foot where you can see how pretty she looks on the foot right okay next style is Anne marie Anne marie was such a winner that we brought her back based on popular demand so we we had done we had we had developed her and we did very well with her. We skipped a season and we had so many customers asking us to bring her back, especially now she's even more product right. Sometimes we're a little fast as far as our styling. But here you have Anne Marie and she will be adjustable in the front and also hook and loop on the ankle strap. She's got a padded heel. She has a snake print on the outsole and also the cork um, midsole. Lots of padding, super duper padded, and then you also have your jute with your rainbow stitching there. Really cool, really colorful, and super comfortable. So the lady performs so well, Lady Gaga, we call her Laga. You can see why she's something that everybody would enjoy wearing and everybody did enjoy wearing based on our reorders. The asymmetrical flowers up the side, this, the uh, flexible, bottom has more of a sporty effect that you can see there and then the upper part of the outsole is wrapped in that same black and white um, jute look with your alternating uh, black and white and then you can see the padded out the padded back strap and then of course you have your hook and loop i'm going to show you the install a little the footbed is so comfortable you can see all of the um, arch support and padding here um, she's an all dayer for sure and this is in our platform And we did do Zazera for her as well because we wanted to offer a slide. I do own Zazera. I love her very much. And you can see why, because I can adjust her crazily all the way. She opens up and is fully, fully adjustable. And yet she, at the same time, she has really cool buckles and she has wonderful foot coverage. We're offering her this season in the one color, in the purple multi, as you see on Angie's foot. And because of the success of this construction, we wanted to show you a new style called Rodies. She's offered in this blue, really denim friendly. But the difference here from Laga, aside from the initial design, is that she's got a really pretty soft floral metallic look. So she still has your leather um, multi, multi petaled flowers with your cabochon jewels in the middle and then a, meta a really pretty leather metallic print. And then of course, a little bit of tooling in the back. 
Okay, Santorini. Everybody should know Santorini. She is a key item for us. She, all she does is reorder, 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 reorder. And the reason why is because not only is she super comfortable and flexible, but she's fun. She has stitch detailing. You can see that she has a thong style, but also a toe loop. So it's a toe loop thong that you, that you can slip your foot right in there. This is your dark brown multi and your white multi, really key colors for us. All of them are. And even as go so far as to say how pretty the insole, that, that footbed is with all of the hand painted flowers there. The jewels really stand out and they are stitched down in the form of a flower. Even the backs and the outsoles are all hand painted. So Santorini is a must for everybody. Style birdie. So again, you're seeing not so much sneakers anymore, but people are still looking for their casuals and they're upgrading from wearing sneakers. And that's why we're so perfectly situated. This has a little bit of a sporty bottom where you can see that orange racy stripe along with the white part of the bottom, but the welt is clear. And then you have your, your stitching detail, our, our um, colorful rainbow stitching. So that makes her really fun. The rainbow stitching is all the way around and then she's got some really very, very sturdy, strong hook and loop closure there. And you can see the asymmetrical flowers up the side for this wonderful slide. And in the same construction, we also wanted to do the back strap. So here you have your open back here, your adjustable here and your adjustable here. So what you're left with is the sturdiness and the solidness of um, your asymmetrical strap and look how pretty even your hand painted details are on this footbed. She's got really pretty metallics in her hand tool design. And you can see the leather is wrapped all the way around the back and she's embellished with some studding design, which is also really um, trend right going forward with some buckles. Delight was uh, an absolute winner here. You can see how high she is in the ranking. She is really beautiful in every way. I mean, what can I say about her? You can see it for yourself. The colors were really soft and feminine. The asymmetrical flowers up the side. The white was really fun and navy. And then of course we did this great gray and mint color. And I wanna show you how pretty this bag, again, Western inspired. She actually goes with really all the colors. So I pulled her out just because of, she had a little bit of a mint going on, even in the gray. And you can see how pretty she is with the navy too. But this mint color is very, very popular going forward. You're going to see her a lot for spring 23. Swan, key item for us. What you see here is three different straps with different um, hand painting. Actually, there's a fourth if you, if you sort of count them that way. She is adjustable, and you can have a different design on each of these straps, all hand painted and tooled, really pretty. And this is our key construction as far as a fork wedge. Tanja, another key item here. What you see is all of your adjustability, one, two, three. Um, key item for us also. So not a lot of embellishments here. So for your customers who don't want the uh, floral embellishment, but they want to experience the Laratis brand with the hand painting details and all the hand tooling and in our key construction, which is this great wedge, the Leather is wrapping right around the entire wedge, and here's a new color for you, and this is in that white multi. So she has the white, the tan, and then also a darker tan. Polka. So look how cute Polka is. Polka has the leather going right around the upper part of the outsole. She has dual, very strong hook and loop. And you can see how pretty the inside is on that etching with all the details there. So wonderful shelf appeal. And the matching footbed for the upper. So you have your two colors there. You have your camel and also your mint multi with very pretty architectural sort of um, one, two, like really kind of avant-garde flowers there on both straps. We had a, uh, a style last season that we, we did very well with and you see her here in Gardeny. Gardeny is a new upper, but on that same construction. So she has super duper padding. She has all of this midsole, tons and tons of cork. 
I, I'm going to say that this in quotes, the diamond welt. You know they're crystals, but I like to call them diamonds. So that when your gal looks down at her feet, she's sparkling all over. As you can see um, on Angie's foot, when she tips her foot up there, you can see the diamonds twinkling. And so when we're walking and we look down at our feet, that's what makes us so happy and so joyful. Look at the wonderful foot coverage that we have here on Gardenia as well. So she is very strong hook and loop. Really pretty center flower with your wonderful coverage on both inside and outside. The bottom part is a clear, you can, oh, you can see her. She's like more of a sporty type of a look and she has that clear uh, sole. And that was part of the dialogue, um, what we were talking about as far as a, a construction that we did and that we had great success with. So dialogue with your multi points of adjustability, soft and padded, really cool. That same diamond welt. So when you look down, you see the pretty diamonds in the light. And then we also have this backstrap style with a D ring, multiple D ring here. And she has a toe loop. All the hand tooling is on the inside here, all wraps around. And then you have your stretch welt, your stretch, um, Gusset there on the inside for a little bit more movement and your foot nestles right in there and she covers up that part of the gal's bunion. So with the popularity of casuals, we've always done really, really well with our clogs. Spiky is no exception. For the gals that wear clogs, I'm a clog wearer as well. We wear them when we wanna cover the front of our foot. She's very comfortable. I love the fact that she's pretty. So clogs don't have to be clunky and she's an all day comfortable construction. I do own this construction and she's for sure an all day. -er. She's lightweight, she's flexible, full coverage, pretty, pretty laser cut and hand painted flower design on the upper and also wraps around on the outside of that heel. And then when we get to the inside, what you see is the laser cuts a little bit um, tonal there and the embellishment on the outside um, is um, decorative decorative embellishment. This is a style that I have that I wear that I love, the Lizzie Rose. I have her in the Lizzie without the roses. I have her in the solid. Um, she's an all day or I wear her a lot at the trade shows because I can slip her on in easily, but she's so, so, so comfortable. And the roses really dress her up a little bit. So you can wear her a little bit dressier if you wanted. You can see the rose painting is all the way on the upper and on the outside as well. She's got an adjustable strap with stretch behind her. Pretty, pretty colorations on those roses. And she also goes right around the back and the etching continues as you go right onto the inside. And on the same construction, we wanted to give you something a little bit different. And because she's so comfortable, we called her Anna. So, ah, for relief for your feet. So she, when you put your foot in her, she's so comfortable. This is that same construction. And what I love about the Anna is the fact that we did her in a leather metallic. She has floral um, edging, scalloped floral daisy edging there, all laser cut. And then it goes all the way around the entire part of the heel, which is really special. It's that same design that you see on the upper part of the vamp. And the rose design is super, super pretty. Very, very feminine and, and, um, and pretty. Astra. Astra is a new construction for us. She's very lightweight. She's really amazingly flexible. A lot of padding here. And what we wanted to do and what we were very happy with um, our success here is that we created this outsole that has a little bit of a cork a wooden cork design and she's also adjustable and she has pretty pretty buckles here they have um, a western influenced etching design on the rectangular the leather goes all the way around on the outside and you can see a little bit of a scooped up back heel so a little bit of a driver's heel there and you can see um, a braid on the asymmetrical strap and the other two our um, hook and loops the next style that we're going to show you is well she's sort of the brother the brethren, brother, she's the sister. She's the, she's the they of Astra and she's called popular. So you have the four colors that we'll be doing and it's the same basic design, but with a backstrap because we know a lot of your gals 
can't do the grippies with their toes and they need that back strap. And you'll see that asymmetrical braid design, a little bit more foot coverage in the front and the hook and loop closure in the back. And there's popular. Kindness. So I walked around a whole day in kindness in two different colors when we were first, um, we first got our first development samples in. She was so comfortable, I didn't want to take her off and she's not even my size, she's a little bit small. But she has a really full, nice, comfortable footbed that your foot nestles right in there. She's got a pretty toe jewelry, so right on your big toe and all the way down that asymmetrical, what you see is what I call jewelry for the feet with these flowers. So it does have a little toe loop there. She does have stretch behind the buckle here. And look how cute she's going to be. There's going to be a navy color also, and Doug's going to show you that in a second. There you go. There's the navy coloration that we have not seen yet. It, has, it hasn't come in yet. And then look how pretty this new purse is with the kindness in the black. Just a fun combination. She's a, a snake print there. She's got the pretty flower, and she merchandises really, really well and nicely with the kindness in the black multi. That's almost like a bowling-shaped bag. And then her sister, kindness's sister, is Erica. And again, you can see how beautifully the foot nestles in there for all day comfort. She's so comfortable. Uh, I can't wait to get the kindness because that's you know right up my alley. With the, with the little toe jewelry. Here you have your hook and loop, your asymmetrical design. She's also hook and loop here, so she does open all the way. And she even has a third hook and loop there. So she's, she's a triple treat there, and she has some pretty nice um, tooling etching design on the footbed as well. Great foot coverage on the outside, and look how comfortable she is with all this padding. And she has a snake midsole there too, which is really fun. Amy's one of my favorites, and, and one of the reasons I love her so much is because she's got a little bit of, um, she's, she's different. She, she definitely dances to her own beat. She's feminine, and yet she's classic at the same time with a little bit of tough edge to her. So when I say feminine, she's got this really, really feminine, nice, gentle slope with the stems of the flowers on both sides. So you do have your opening all the way for your full adjustability. And look how pretty the stems will we'll hold the foot there and they make such a statement on the outside of their foot, don't they? The leather goes all the way around, all that tooling. Look at how fun this outsole is. She's super duper as far as a shape. She's got sort of a curvy, sexy, edgy shape going on there and the colors, we're pleased with how the colors came out um, in these three. We wanted to go a little bit more edgy here with a little bit of a higher um, construction. This is styled Jexa, so she does have a sporty look. She's very, very padded, and in this case you have two-tone outsoles. In the navy you have the, a little bit of a purple accent, and you can see here how she is also fully adjustable. So she's more in that flat form, um, flat form comfort range, and I'm going to show you. So the, outs, the, the sole is so high. The sole comes to about one and three quarters, and then there's extra in the midsole for all that cork. So when you're at the top, you're at three, three inches. And then here, you're at two. So she's really not a true flat form. She's more of a wedge, but she's super cool and super comfortable. And look how cute this bag is going to be with her. So this is um, Monarch, and she's a drawstring. Very, very traditional, and yet we wanted to snazz her up a little bit with some contrasting flowers and some butterflies and contrasting um, navy. And she looks really pretty with this style that we call Gaxa. So we, of, of course we have to do a back strap too. And what you see on Angie's foot is the blue with the burgundy. And this particular color, and I think we call her camel, she will also have a two-tone outsole. So she'll be the same as what we saw in the Gaxa. In a two-tone, she'll be like a camel right smack in the middle there. And she is also fully adjustable. Um, she has a really pretty um, footbed design going on there with some pretty um, uh, painted trees or palm trees looking, and a padded backstrap as well. Pretty lightweight too. She's, a, she's very deceiving. So most of you have probably um, 
have probably brought Style Shelly into the stores. And I hope you have and you continue with her. She's super comfortable. I own this construction in a different upper and I love her a lot. She's sort of that steampunk look, but believe it or not, she's an all dayer and then some. So she's an all dayer and into the night. So Shelly has your adjustability as far as your um, straps and then you have a nice full coverage flower on the front. And we are adding an ice icy color, like a pinky icy white color that we're um, due in any day now to round out the assortment as far as colorations. Okay, style lay, we're gonna go down a little bit. Lay is a very lightweight, one of our key ranked styles. She's in the top 10, as you can see, she ranked number eight this past season, um, and for good reason. She's a go-to sandal for most of our gals. Um, they love everything about her. They love the good foot coverage. They love the flexibility, the softness. They love that they can wear her dressy and casual. And then she has a little bit of a rocker back driver bottom and the leather on the outside wraps all the way around with your really nice um, sort of basket weave upper and your embellished strap. And look how cute this is. This is that monarch here that we wanted to show you with the red style. Cute, right? Drawstrings are always really popular. They're making a comeback. I know they come and go, but you can see how, how great she is and she has um, this really nice strap, shoulder strap. On that same lay construction, we have Ariella. Ariella, we wanted to do something with flowers because lay was a little bit more classic. So Ariella has this great floral asymmetrical design that we do so well with. She is also hook and loop with a very pretty chain, antique chain, um, embellished buckle and the cabochon jewels up the front and I'm not sure if your sheets say um, fuchsia but we have it really is a dark pink and that's what we've changed the name to in case your sheet doesn't say it it is dark pink and staying with the same construction which is a key construction for us is Ajva so Ajva has that same nice cork looking uh, bottom with the wrapping around here, nice padded outsole, still staying with the asymmetrical flowers, which our customers love. Pretty, pretty coloration. So you see lots of, uh, lots of different colors in the uppers. And this is style Ajva. Rose, this next style is Rosa Maria. There's three great colors here. So what we love about Rosa Maria is she's a new construction and because of the success of style lay that we just showed you and the new styles that we, the new uppers that we showed you, we wanted to go a little bit taller because I know a lot of our customers like to have a little height. So she measures two inches in the back and then her platform is about three quarters. So really it's one and a quarter as a gentle slope. But look how pretty the colors are. So we have not only vivids, what you see here in the red, and that's part of the trend. You have vivids and dusties, but we also do this. It's so pretty in the dusties, right? And look how pretty the footbed is. So you have a nice um, etching flowers there, and you have full adjustability here in Rosa Maria. Style Isna was a key style for us. She had great reorder. She was a new style for us this past um, this past season, she's very flexible with lots of padding. She has adjustability. And what I really like about her is that she's got good foot coverage and yet a lot of aeration, right? So your leather goes right around to the upper. She's very lightweight and very pretty and feminine. And she has just um, all day wear. And because of the popularity of Isness Construction, we wanted to do a clog. I can't wait to get um, my feet into Augie because Augie is a really pretty clog. A lot of times the clogs, and you know, not ours, our clogs are all pretty, but a lot of times you see these full clogs and they're a little bit plainer. And this we wanted to have that perfect l'artiste embellished upper with the hand painted flowers. And then also these really pretty dainty flowers on the, the edge of the vamp with some either pearls or embellished cabochons. And just so you know, she also has a little bit of a stretch inset there and she's very soft and flexible. So everybody knows the Cayman and the Sumaka construction. You know why, because she's, they just sell, they continue to sell. So we have the five colors here in Cayman. Everybody's familiar with her. She does have your hook and loop. So she's, you're snug as a bug in there. You have your matching footbed. She's light as a weight 
and she's very, very flexible. And she's got lots of family. So you start with Cayman and you go to Sumaka who has the back strap. And here what we have is a triple treat of adjustability, one, two, three, and then the back strap is also adjustable with a buckle. But that's the Sumaka, so triple treat with lots of great coloration, similar to the Cayman. Bigger family is Pillow. So Pillow is also in the top 10 as another slide. And the difference here is you've got a little bit of a upper design here on the back of the heel. She's got that same wonderful uh, feature as far as adjustability here and cabochon jewels and matching footbeds to the uppers. And of course we have Goody. So Goody is another asymmetrical. You have here the red. The white is really special because she has that contrast black with the orange and that makes her super cool. And then also gray. So there's, there's a lot of unusual colorations here that perhaps some of your customers don't already have in their closet. So that makes them very, very wearable and very saleable. And there's your pillow, um, goodie rather. Jolina Daisy. So we had Jolina and then we added a Daisy print here. So all of the upper is Daisy printed. And you can see she also is a triple treat of adjustability. And on the inside, you can see the signature rainbow stitching that we love and our customers also love. The print here is so joyful and so pretty. You can see all the colorations are really saleable and very, very joyful and soft. But we also wanted to expand the family. This family keeps growing because of her popularity. And here you see Snazzy. So Snazzy is a party on your feet. And this in particular, because the embellishment is more of a T-strap design here. She does, of course, have hook and loop closure. But look at the embellishment on the front in that T-strap. She's got it's like a confetti. It's really like a, a super duper party for your, for your feet. Especially when you look down and you can see all the joyful colors. She's got metallic and she's got all little balls and all different colored leaves and cut out and etching. So she's really super cool. And you can see that the outsole will match to the upper as well. And then alas, the family has stopped growing. And here you have Charlene. Charlene is also joyful in the fact that she has metallic, so she can be worn a little bit dressier, perhaps. You've got that pretty yellow color on um, Angie's foot. Oh, that's Francis's foot. And then you also have some daisy embellishments there with pearls in the middle, and pearls are still trending really nicely. And your, your leather material wraps right around the back. So we do casuals, we do athleisure, and we can't call them sneakers because they're too great to be called sneakers, just a sneaker. So, and here what's so great about Jazzy is aside from the actual design, she does have a removable foot, but I'm gonna tuck her back in there. Look how pretty the materials are here and the mixes. So we have the leather laser cuts in a pinwheel design with all this hand painting design. And then you know anytime we have um, laces that she's all adjustable. So she really can open up wide or lace up really narrow. She's got a padded tongue with a keeper so that this tongue stays situated. But the best part about that is that she is a zip. So once you decide and once you your customer laces herself in there, she never has to touch those laces again unless she swells because she's got that zip. The special part here, in addition to the actual style and the upper, is look at how beautiful the outsole is. It's all painted on the outsole and even on the bottom. So she's really, really fun and we really love her and she's very lightweight. And we also wanted to do another casual with this really cool bottom. She's splayed out a little bit. She's got a little bit of a newspaper print going on there and she's got metallic two-tone laces also. This is a mesh upper with embroidered daisies and in the middle of each daisy all the way around is a metallic center. So it's true, true embroidery. So she's super cool. She also has that padded, um, the padded tongue there. And she also has the keeper for the metallic and a padded collar. Look at the bottom. So aside from the label, you can see the newsprint goes right through the sole. So the newsprint outsole is all the way around with the multiple um, different um, shabby chic sort of design there. And then you see you're on the bottom, you see that really cool design. Okay, look at her, look at Zingy. 
Zingy has a lot of zang, doesn't she? She's super, super colorful. She's super fun. She's almost like a Studio 54 type of a sneaker. I'm aging myself, aren't I? So Studio 54, you got lots of sparkles going on here. You've got your padded collar and you've got your metallic laces. She also has that newsprint um, outsole with the same see-through at the bottom, not only in, in this bigger spot here at the heel, but also in the upper too. I'm gonna, well, we'll show it to you. Let me take this off a little bit so you can see it. So look at, you can see that it's like a, like a grading work, right? And you can see all the way through there. I think she's super, super duper. Um, love her. Fun, fun, fun. And then we wanted to make something a little bit higher because again, flat forms and platforms and wedges are still trending really high. And we called her a cooler. So cooler is super cool. She's got a higher vertically indentated, um, sort of driver bottom on the outsole. She's got a padded back. This is all lace. She's really see-through lace, but she's not sheer sheer. She's just a little sheer. And she has almost like a cotton chenille look on the upper, all the way knitted through here, all the way on the outside. And she's got these great eyelets on the top also. So of course she has the padded tongue and she's got lots of flexibility and comfort. And then we're gonna go to, oh, we're gonna put this on model because we only had the one style. And then we're gonna to go to Louis Cool Cat, John. So you see two uppers on here. It's a zip, so you have again that same adjustability that we talked about earlier on this snazzy style. And you see that you have the metallic lace with the, with the same construction that is going to be on Francis in about a minute that you'll see with that higher outsole. And she's really, really cool. And here you see her on Francis. And that's style cooler. Isn't she cool? I even love the eyelets that she's got a little bit of a tough chick going on there as well. And you see all the padding around the, not only the exterior, the upper, of, but also at the heel. Okay. So you've got cooler and cool cap. Louis cool cap. <laughs> and now we're going to move on to Cassandra flower. So Cassandra was a closed up style that we've been doing and very successful again with reorders. She is a Mary Jane style and what happens in what's been happening is that people are getting out of those athletic styles and they're moving into something a, a little bit more upscale, so to speak. And <clears throat> Cassandra Floor really fits the bill here because for those of you that are familiar with our Chino and Burbank construction, it's like washing, walking on marshmallows and Cassandra has that same inside. She's flexible, she's got full foot coverage. You can see a nice wide roomy footbed for the gals who need a little bit of room um, there. And yet she has a nice feminine upper with the pretty, pretty colorations and the really pretty feminine laser cuts. New style for us and we're really happy with the way she came out. We did so well with a style called gloss and these, these closed up styles. And this is Americana. So Americana has a slightly shallower upper on the vamp, but she has just as pretty, she has all these pretty laser cuts, very toned, a little bit of an ombre effect that you can see. She has the um, traditional hook and loop closure there. She's got the wonderful construction. Whoops, I'm out of the frame here. She's got the wonderful construction as far as um, a proven winner here. and. I love the ombre and I also love the comfort features here. The pretty color that's on Francis's foot is that sky color. And look how awesome this bag is. So you can see this particular bag. And the reason we're sh showing you some seasonal, um, less seasonal colors is because we wanted you to be able to take advantage of uh, longer selling periods. So you can bring these styles in earlier, you can bring them in a little bit later, you can flow your goods in, and then you can still have viability all year round styles, um, depending on where you are. And this, we really love the, everything about this particular handbag. Because of the colors, she just goes with everything. And Americana is gonna be a key style for us because we already know how great gloss does and it's the same construction. And you can see the great colorations in gloss. Another year-round core item for us. And you can see the wonderful colorations. She still does, um, she still just sells like crazy for us, especially in the reorder. And for those of you who are familiar with her, you know that you can fill into her whenever you need her. Style Labora is a key item for us. She's still, still in the line. Here's just a few of the colors. She has the flexibility and the full coverage here with your twin 
um, upper gores and a really cool outsole. She's an all dayer, she's an all year rounder, and Labora is still in our line as a key item. Excuse me. So is Copa. Copa is our bumper toe style, which everybody knows and loves. I love my bumper toes. I wear her a lot. Um, I wear her with socks. I wear her barefooted. Um, Copa is really festive and joyful, and she's really lightweight, and she's very, very, um, very, very comfortable. And she's just fun. She's just a really cool style. And any of our any of our bags that you see with all the multicolors. <clears throat> they just blend in there. You can see the, the rainbow stitching on the upper there. This is Minnie, and Minnie's been a really great bag for us because she's a little on the smaller side. Some of the gals don't want, you know, some of the big bags. You know, you got, you got, all, you got a, all, all types of gals. They all love big or small. Popcorn. Look how cute popcorn is. So popcorn has a little bit more coverage in a clog style, and she's sort of a semi-bumper toe. We just lowered the bumper a little bit. She's still lightweight. She's still flexible. She has hook and loop here for a little adjustability, and the fun part about her is oh, she's so strong. She has Velcro. Um, really a nice removable footbed where if your gal or your customer needs to put in her doctor ordered orthotics they will fit beautifully in there and they will nestle right inside there but because of the comfort of these particular insoles she may be able to just wear ours den of eden we had a lot of great feedback on the den of eden um, for the season She's got the dual gore. She's cool. She's hip. She's a true flat form as far as um, where she stands for and in height. And she has a wonderful removable. Look at the look at how padded this is um, in the heel and also in the footbed. She's got that removable footbed. So if you gal again, if she needs it for her orthotics, she's got that leather pull tab and a really pretty soft metallic coloration on the uppers that you can see there. And then we have Danley Bloom. So Danley Bloom is a key item for us. We're continuing with her. She started our more in our athleisure styles. And again, she, she has that zipper. So once you, um, once you lace her up, all you have to do is zip yourself in there. You never have to touch the laces again in case you, in, unless you swell. But the one thing that we love about her is that she's got this really cool outsole. Um, and she's got the rainbow stitching and very flexible as well. Look how fun Dandeliona is. So Dandeliona is got this clear outsole, the same as Dan, the same as what we just showed you in Danley Bloom, with all the rose detailing on the bottom. But she's clear, she's see-through, and the upper is metallic. She's very, very fun and joyful, and she has this hand-painted, really feminine, pretty abstract flower there. Again, she's got the laces, so you can lace yourself right in there and padding all the way around the upper part of the. Um, of this of this casual along with your rainbow stitching on the outside so everybody knows Desi everybody should know Desi we love Desi look at her how could you not love her right look at all the colorations so she really speaks volumes just in colors alone you can make a wonderful presentation on the selling floor um, and you can even do it seasonally if you wanted to. So you could bring in some of the lighter colors if you wanted to do something in the um, in the lighter colors or your joyful colors. We have a great navy. So you do a navy red here. And then you can even bring them in a little bit different time frame and bring in some darker colorations. But Desi should be in everybody's assortment. And we know because of her flexibility and her comfort and her great foot coverage that she's an all-dayer for our customers. And then we wanted to show you one of our new purses that we just brought in and she's more of a scoop style she's very soft and smushy she's got dual um, strapping here she's got the softer strap uh, the shorter strap that you can remove or she has a longer strap that you can remove either way but we love all the colorations here and that's scooped so there you have Desi okay and then we have to show you Chino and Burbank and then their siblings that are more Mary Jane in style. So Chino is our clog. She's one of our top sellers, of course. You are all familiar with her. With I call her the marshmallow. When I push my, foot, my, my finger in here, 
um, my finger doesn't have the strength of my heel, your heel sinks right in there, maybe a half an inch. That's, I, that's why I call her the marshmallow. She has great comfort as far as your um, side uh, stretch and just a really pretty all year basic clog. Everybody loves her. And she's closed toe. A lot of people need to wear those closed toes and all day comfort. I know my girlfriend wears that. For, she's a pharmacist, so she wears that um, all day in the pharmacy. And here you have Anaria in more of a Mary Jane style. And she's pretty because she has a really feminine um, little peak there in the front and a little bit of a, a nice sort of daisy design cut out in the laser cuts. Same construction with that marshmallow footbed. And look at Anana. Anana's all floral, very, very pretty, very feminine. She even has a flower on the end of the um, Mary Jane strap. And she still has that wonderful marshmallow footbed that you sink right in there and you just like just want to cavell because she's so, so comfortable. And you see all those pretty colorations on the upper. And then we have, ta -da -da, we have Burbank. So multiple colors in Burbank. She's our closed clog. Um, everybody loves Burbank. She's a key item for us. She's always in the top. Um, she's always in the top ratings. You can see a, an array of colorations. Purple is on, <clears throat> on Francis's foot. And this is where it all began as far as these marshmallow bottoms between the Chino and the Burbank. And there you have it. Spring L'Artiste 2023.